Hey, I'm Shan and I am doing another 10 minute update for my making a music video series. <laughs> um, right, so I'm going to show you what I've been up to. Uh, Sunday, it's kind of a lazy day, um, but I've been at this for hours, <laughs> hours and hours. Oh, hi kitty. Right, so behind me there, right, is the spider web scene that I said yesterday that I was going to do. I did get that done. I'm really, really happy with it. I think it's like exactly what I wanted. It's cool because uh, I'm going to be able to put myself um, struggling in the middle and this mad, big, horrible, long-legged spider coming up from this corner here. So that's my plan for that one. So I'm, yay, that's done. Um, and then as you can see here, my awesome dragon. Um, I didn't want to admit it fully yesterday, although I suspected as much. It's too big. It's too big. What was I thinking? Um, so I'm going to have to do the same dragon, but I'm going to do him like a third of the size, I would say. Uh, uh, yeah, so I didn't spend much time doing, working out like the neck joints or whatever, because he's just too big. Um, so I wondered why the hell I did a gigantic, uh, ridiculously big dragon, like obviously ridiculously big dragon. And I thought, oh, well, maybe, maybe it has something to do with, um, worrying about my grandma. I have a Welsh grandma. I have an English grandma and a Welsh grandma and they're both in like coming up into their mid nineties. Uh, if you can, if you can fathom that. Um, but my Welsh grandma is like my English grandma is okay. She's in a home. She's a bit down because people can't uh, visit her, but my Welsh grandma is living in her own house on her own and she's finding it really difficult because people can't visit or they just like, she wants people to come in um, but people are like, no, I don't want to be responsible for giving you anything. Uh, so she's finding it very, very hard and she can't use the phone, uh, too much anymore. So she used to ring me a lot, but she doesn't ring me as much and she can't write either. Cause I do a lot of, I write letters to my grandmas. I, I've been writing to my grandmas for years, especially my Welsh grandma, because, um, my Welsh grandma is a bit like me. She she used to send me when she could write like pages and pages and pages of all this description and 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 that's what I do to her. She loves my she loves my letters because I can just write forever. Um, I'm a bit more concise with my English grandma. They're very different. They're like complete opposite people. It's funny, but yeah. So I thought mm, maybe that was the reason why I went berserko doing a gigantic dragon. I don't know because uh, I'm I'm kind of looking into the the shadow self uh, side of things as well. Anyway, I'm going to show you what I was doing um, for the last couple of hours. Right. This is going to be my um, stop motion raining. So here, if you can see underneath, this is the, um, the window that I made because the first, so what is it? The first line is the first couple of lines is in lockdown, watching the rain, I could sit here and stare all day. So um, here is going to be, let's see, uh, that's the seat. I'm going to, I'm going to actually just put a, a silhouette of me sitting there and there's going to be stop motion of the hours going by. And then the plan is there's going to be stop motion rain falling. So I did, as I told you yesterday, uh, explain how I was going to do the stop motion rain. So I am like um, putting all these raindrops onto clear paper and I'm going to go all the way up to here so that I can, when I do the stop motion, I can start up here and then like every frame just have a ton of um, falling raindrops. So I'm going to go, I'm going to do the raindrops to at least here um, to get get as much as I need. I mean, it's always better to have more than you need. Um, I find that because it's very depressing uh, when you've decided, okay, I'm done with that job, I'm moving on. It's really depressing to have to return to jobs um, to do them experience. And in, yeah, and that dragon thing, that's just, that's just uh, put it, chalk it down to experience as well. You got to do these things, even though that dragon took me hours and I, all the templates took me hours. So that's like hours of work, just, okay, I can't use that. But um, I guess it's all experience, isn't it? 
It's all experience. I was watching, or I wasn't, I was listening. It was on YouTube, but I was listening to um, Joe Rogan's new podcast with Matthew McConaughey, <laughs> the dude from Texas. Uh, he was in Dallas Buyers Club and um, the first season of, uh, what was it called again? True Detective? Was it True Detective? Mo. That's all I remember from that. He was like really... Um, Mole. <laughs> That's what he did. Uh, and, and I still do it to Jimmy and Jimmy laughs. Mole. But uh, what was he saying? Oh, he was going on about raw expression. Well, because he was he was promoting a book. That's why. I mean, most people go on the Joe Rogan podcast because they want to promote like a book or a film or whatever, whatever they're doing. And he was promoting his book because he's been apparently keeping memoirs for like 36 years. And he was going on about like... Um, there was always people in the way of my raw expression. <laughs> raw. He kept on going on about this raw expression, which is actually what I'm doing right now. This is my raw expression. Um, but it's not for like anything other than I can't be bothered to sit down and edit and stuff. Um, it's just much easier to pick up the camera and rant for 10 minutes and put it down and post it up. And it's like done in the space of half an hour, even less. It's... Um, it's done, but like, you know, uh, filming and editing and all that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, I just, I don't have time for it because this is what all my time is being dedicated to. This is my, uh, my crafting table. Well, it was our, it was our dining table, but it's now my crafting table. Um, and what am I going to do? So I think tonight, I think tonight, all right, I'm going to get the teardrops finished. Why do I keep on calling them teardrops? They're raindrops. Uh, I'm going to get the raindrops finished um, and I'm going to redo a smaller dragon and I'm going to do the spider, I think. The spider for the spider's web scene. I'm really happy with that uh, spider web scene. And when Jimmy came down, because Jimmy's upstairs uh, working on his modular synths, like I think it's a DFAM or something, He's upstairs uh, working on tunes. Um, when he came down yesterday uh, and saw it, he said, this is gonna be a really good video. So he thought it was pretty cool too. Jimmy's upstairs uh, at the moment working on his album. Jimmy, myself and Jimmy are gonna do a second Lamb Dancer album um, soon, but he wants to get his album out first, obviously. And he's, um, he's working away on it religiously um, every spare, hour that he gets he's up in his room working on music so I'm really dying to hear that album because Jimmy Jimmy's stuff is absolutely amazing anyway it it always was like that's why that's how we met um I was he contacted me asking me to collaborate and I listened to his stuff and I thought oh that's cool I like I like that stuff uh so Jimmy for me has always been uh great but over the last couple of years after all the modular synth stuff that he's been collecting He's been getting different machines, different machines. Uh, they've all got weird names, like something from another mother. And I don't know, they're, they're um, yeah, they've all got weird kind of names. But he has been collecting all these modular synths and uh, developing his style and stuff. And, and it's just really, he's, his stuff is just beautiful. Um, it, 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 like he can have really banging tunes, but he also has uh, some really beautiful ambient layer, like the layering that he does is just so stunning. So, um, so yeah, I'm really looking forward to Jimmy's album. I think it's going to be an absolutely amazing album. And that is where Jimmy is right now, but he's coming downstairs soon to make me lasagna. Yay! vegan lasagna of course but uh he loved his pizza last night so he's gonna make me um vegan lasagna tonight because i love lasagna i love jimmy's lasagna more than anything right so that's today's 10 minute rant 10 minute installation of my raw expression <laughs> god what an intense dude i don't think i'd ever like to meet him in, in real life to be honest with you but it was interesting enough okay so from the dragon and the cobwebs and uh, the raindrops and me, I will see you for another update soon. Bye. Oh, I didn't show the kitten today, but she's asleep on the couch. So maybe some other time. Bye.